Hey everyone, thanks for checking out another bonus episode of The New Marketing Show. Catch us on YouTube, Instagram, TV, our website, all that great stuff. So today, I want to start talking about the giving season. I want to start talking about Giving Tuesday, which is December 2nd, uh, first Tuesday after Thanksgiving. Pretty sure it's second. It's the first or the second. I'm pretty sure it's a second. And what it means this year with our current reality of events being canceled and limited capacity and what it means in the fundraising world. So, a couple of quick thoughts. Giving Tuesday was the greatest secret weapon for small NPOs, nonprofit organizations, probably created in a long time. But, know this. The big guys are onto it now. They know how powerful Giving Tuesday is. They see the tweets. They see the impact that it has on small NPOs. And you better believe it that this year, of all years, they will be jumping on that bandwagon and jumping in the Giving Tuesday game stronger than ever and probably more strategic and probably ready to execute at the highest level. Here's why. With all the COVID-19 stuff going on since March, galas, golf outings, auctions, any other type of fundraising event were canceled or limited in capacity and moved online. Almost all NPOs now have an online giving mechanism. If they don't, they've lost. I mean, flat out. It's like, it's not even like they're losing, like they've lost. So what happens is now is the Comans of the world, the American Heart Association, all of those great organizations. I don't want to, and, and don't take me wrong. Don't get me wrong here. I do think that those are great organizations and I think that they do great stuff. But what happens is now is they're getting in this game also and it's going to be the noisiest giving season ever. Now, with Giving Tuesday oh, in the last couple of years being in December, a lot of times what people are doing, they're rolling a Giving Tuesday campaign right into their year-end appeals. So right now, as we talk middle of October, is the time for you to start strategizing. It's a time for you to start developing your personas. It's a time for you to start developing your strategic messaging. Figure out what story of your NPO connects with whom and how you're going to connect dots. How are you going to get them? It's time for you to figure out the creative. Right now, you have to execute at the highest level ever. You can't just go out and expect you know, a couple of tweets or a couple of Instagram posts or Facebook posts to raise a significant dollar amount. Whoever execute best this giving season is going to get the lion's share of donations. Everybody right now is competing for the same discretionary donation money from either corporate donors, individuals, their constituents, etc. So be smart, plan, plan, plan. Execute your plan, review, refine, repeat, and make sure that you're on point to at least get the dollars that your constituents typically give you so that you can nurture them further down the continuum. Hey, thanks for watching. For more videos like this, you can get us on YouTube. You can get us at The New Marketing Show, wherever you get your podcasts. So keep checking us out. Thank you.